Stop, stop, stop. 20 minutes later. He didn't give us a chance. He said, move over. <laughs> and this, this is how you know that Drake has molds in his camp. Because Kendrick, 20 minutes later, dropped a song called Meet the Grams. Playing on the family theme of Drake's Family Matters. So Kendrick knew that knew. Drake had mm -hmm. a Family Matters record. Absolutely, 100%. I, I'm a thousand percent on that one. He knew that he knew of that record. So he's like, bet he's coming at my family. I got something for his family. So this was a direct response to Drake. Uh, family Matters record 20 minutes. Wouldn't even let it breathe. Let's get into it. This is Kendrick Lamar. That's the perfect way to play it, too, because it's smart. like it, I, I completely smart. forgot about Drake's record right. after I heard that because he dropped the bomb. Yeah, he did. He did. And it, it was it wasn't like it was like, okay, we did the fun stuff, we did this, we did that. Let's right. get straight into horror rap. Right. And I'm gonna be completely objective here, guys. I I know it seems like I've been sliding more on the Kendrick side, but I'm gonna be I got some thoughts and opinions on this record you guys are gonna wanna hear. I'm gonna be objective on this as well too. All right, so let's get into it. This is Meet the Grams with Kendrick Lamar. Let's get it. Starting all his records with that dun 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 dun. Yeah. Shit, it's probably it's haunting I'm dreams. sorry that that man is your father. Let me be honest. It takes a man to be a man. Your dad is not responsive. I look at him and wish your grandpa would have wore a condom. I'm sorry that you gotta grow up and then stand behind him. Life is hard, I know. The challenges always go beat us home. Sometimes our parents make mistakes that affect us until we grow. And hey, you're a good kid that need good leadership. Let me be your mentor since your daddy don't teach you shit. Never mm. let let a man pitch mm. your leg, son Either you die right there or pop that man in the head, son Never fall in the escort business, that's bad religion Please remember, you could be a bitch even if you got bitches Never code switch And that's a fact <laughs> right or wrong, you're a black man, even if it don't benefit your goals Do some push-ups, get some discipline Don't cut them corners like your daddy did Fuck what Olympic did Don't pay to play with them Brazilians Get a gym membership Under <laughs> You look so complex <laughs> Cause every time I hear it yeah, It's like It gets it gets deeper Oh Um Oh Alright Oh He said fuck what Olympic did Stop hanging with them Brazilians Like or what <laughs> What <laughs> <laughs> he just said Dre BBL like four times. <laughs> yeah. And the album artwork is something also that probably should be talked about more as well, too. Because oh, yeah, because he started with the glyph. He was like, but we can go deeper if you want. Yeah. The um yeah, exactly. With the six um the six sixteen in LA, it was just a picture of the glove. Mm -hmm. Didn't really know what that meant exactly. People were trying to figure it out. Mm -hmm. But in this record, this is this is just Kendrick showing like I'm ready to take it the next step further, like where this goes. Like, no, nigga, I've been in your home. Yeah, like I, I got some shit, you know what I mean? So um, in this picture, you know, it looks like this is like Drake's luggage where... Um, I think they said it was his father's luggage. Yeah, it was Dennis Graham, which is Drake's dad's um, luggage. But it had Drake's stuff on here. If you look at some of the pills mm -hmm. and stuff like that, it has Olympic and um, some other pills in here as well, too. It all has Drake's name. And, um, and yeah, so pretty much, you know, him proving like, yeah, Drake takes these medications to look slimmer and stuff like that. But yeah. Um, oh, interesting. oh, 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 Zampi. <laughs> get, get, <hey>, young. <laughs> <laughs> Go ahead, Mo. All right. That is crazy. All right. So let's get, let's get back to the record. Stand with throwing rocks and hiding hands, that's law. Don't be ashamed about who you with, that's how he treats your moms. Don't have a kid to hide a kid to hide again, be sure. 5% will comprehend, but 95 is lost. Be proud of who you are. Your strength come from within. A lot of superstars, that's real. But your daddy ain't one of them. And you nothing like him. You'll carry yourself as king. Can't understand me right now. Just play this when you're 18. Play this when you 18. Oh God, I feel like this drink's gonna just like haunt that child forever. This is hard. All right. Um, somebody's gonna play this at his 18th birthday party and just be lie. lurking in the corner. Like Kendrick said, you want to talk about my family? I'm making the whole record about your family, starting off with your son, saying dear Odonis, pretty much saying that you know your father is a horrible father, and let me try to be a dad for you instead. 
Yeah. And then let me give you some guidance, some information on how to be a man, because obviously your dad doesn't. This is completely filed. This is crazy, but perfect for rap beef. I ain't gonna lie. <laughs> 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 but, but for a hip hop, this is some hip hop ass shit. It's I ain't like, gonna lie. This is messy, but keep this, going. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Like, I, I like this shit. I ain't gonna lie. This is fire. This is actually fire. Um, and for the people who was like butthurt saying that like it was too much, I'm like, what? you're clearly in the wrong genre for sure. Yeah. In the wrong section of the club, like <laughs> yeah, yeah, go back to the raids. This, like, this is he should have made another bop. I don't. <laughs> huh. Kendrick said he would have danced. <laughs> I got something. To do yeah, yeah, exactly. To. <laughs> Hold my beer. <laughs> but, but, <laughs> he said, I got, we're gonna have to handle this first. This was just a strategic chess, chess move by Kendrick to just stomp on whatever Drake just did because I ain't gonna lie, he put you whatever fire he lit out. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I think I think Kendrick heard that record from Drake and he didn't want these lies him saying that these are lies about him beating on his wife. I also to- think that he kind of was like, cool, Drake's going to try to make another club hit and pull a Meek Mill. Mm-hmm. We're going to end that right now. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm going to drop the bomb now. Yeah, and then yeah. I'm gonna give you mine. <laughs> yeah, yeah, he's, man, and did, man, did he? All right, we we let's jump the gun. Let's finish this. Mm-hmm, he first mm-hmm, talked to Adonis, mm-hmm. and then next he talks to Drake's mom. This is just this is this is insane, bro. This is so dirty. Dear Sandra, your son got some habits. I hope you don't undermine them, especially with all the girls that's hurt inside this climate. You're a woman, so you know how it feels to be in alignment with emotion, hoping the man can see you and not be blinded. Dear Dennis, you gave birth to a master manipulator. Even using you to prove who he is is a huge favor. I think you should ask for more paper and more paper and more uh, more paper. I'm blaming you for all this gambling addictions, psychopath intuition, the man that like to play victim, you raised a horrible fucking person, the nerve of you Dennis, Sandra sit down, what I'm about to say is heavy, now listen, mm. your son's a sick man with sick thoughts, I think niggas like him should die, him and Weinstein should get fucked up in a cell for the rest they life, he hates black women, hypersexualize him with kinks of a nympho fetish, grew facial hair because he understood being a beard just fit him better, he got sex offenders on Hovio that he keep on the monthly allowance, and a child should never be compromised and he keeping his child around. And we gotta raise our daughters knowing there's predators like him lurking. Fuck a rap battle, he should die so all of these women can live with a purpose. I've been in this. Fuck him up. No, cause like, you should have seen my raw reaction. I said, Oh my god. This is like, um. This is like when you like sitting in on somebody else's family beef and they start just dropping bombs and you're just like, oh, this is a uh, maybe I, maybe I shouldn't be here. <laughs> yeah. Um. So you guys don't know. Um. Uh, Bakum not nice. Also affiliated with OBO Records. Um. By Drake. <laughs> um. Uh, Baka Not Nice uh, began his career as a security guard for Drake and who was charged in 2014 with forcing a 22-year-old woman into prostitution. The rapper, whose real name is Travis, pleaded guilty to the assault, but the prostitution charges were dropped. Um, now, Kendrick is also alluding that there's more, you know, people in that kind of industry uh, <laughs> similar to Baka into some you know pedophilia and stuff like that as well too so this is nasty nasty he said drake hangs work. with the diddler <laughs> pretty much um yeah so yeah I, mm, nasty work nasty nasty work all right let's get let's get let's get back to it man let's get back to it and it's you 12 years, I'ma tell y'all one little secret It's some weird shit going on And some of these artists be here to police it They be streamlining victims all inside of their home And calling them Tinder Then leak videos of themselves to further push their agendas To any woman that be playing this music Know that you're playing your sister Or better yet selling your niece To the weirdos, not the good ones Cat Williams that can hear the truth So I'ma get mine The embassy about to get ready to too It's only a matter of time Hey LeBron, keep the family away Hey Curry, keep the family away To anybody that embody the love for their kids keep Keep the family away, they looking at you too, if you're standing by him. Keep the family away, I'm looking to shoot through any pervert that lives. Keep the family safe. Dear baby girl, I'm 
sorry that your father not active inside your world. Imagine oh, man. you just trying to be messy yeah. and listen to the rap beef, and then they start name dropping your family. Like, uh, uh, <laughs> Mind your own business, eating your oatmeal in the morning. Like, uh, wait, what? Me? <laughs> what did he say me for? <laughs> Look the Keep hell. The fat? What? Can? <laughs> um, <What>? yo. <laughs> I ain't gonna lie. This this is uh, this is a Kendrick misstep. I gotta be fair and I gotta be honest. Okay. Um, matter of fact, I'm gonna let it play all the way through and up this bar. Then I'm gonna tell you why this is a misstep. Don't commit to much, but it's music, yeah, that's for sure. Be a narcissist, misogynist, living inside his songs. Try to destroy families rather than taking care of his own. Should be teaching you timetables or watching Frozen with you. Or at your 11th birthday, singing poems with you. Instead, he'd be in Turks, paying for sex and popping perks. Examples that you don't deserve. I want to tell you that you're loved. You're brave. You're kind. You got a gift to change the world. and can change your father's mind. Because our children is the future. But he lives inside confusion. Money's always been illusion, but that's the life he's used to. His father probably didn't claim him either. History do repeats itself, sometimes it don't need a reason. But I would like to say it's not your fault that he's hiding another child. Give him grace, this the reason I made Mr. Morale. So our babies like you can cope later. Give you some confidence to go through something, it's hope later. I never want to hear you chasing in, cause it's felt behavior. Sitting in the club with sugar daddies for validation. You need to know that love is. Eternity and Trump's all pain. I tell you who your father is, just play the song when it rains. Yes, he's a hit maker, songwriter, superstar, right? And a fucking dead beat that should never say more life. Meet the grounds. Mm, my God. <laughs> fire bar, fire verse. But I think the truth matters. Um, this was a setup. This was a setup by Drake himself. So, um, let me see. Drake denies daughter. Um, Drake took right to his Instagram, um, and pretty much said, Let's see "If I can find it, I hate when these articles know what you're looking for. It's just like, hey, read all this other bullshit that you don't want to see. Like, but before we give you what you want, yeah, like look at all this other stuff. Like, no, like no, let's see." Um, not the underage one, the daughter one. The nice daughter IG post. Yeah, here it is. Okay, so um, Drake went right to his Instagram after Kendrick um <laughs> posted that record. He said, "Nah, hold on." Can someone find my hidden daughter, please, and send her to me? These guys are in shambles. Now, at first, it's like, like, oh, maybe he's just, you know, trying to play it safe and stuff like that. But then it comes out later on that Drake actually set this up himself. You know what I mean? To, like, put out a fake story and stuff like that to see if Kendrick will bite on it and go on to it. So, apparently, this is completely false and actually fabricated by Drake himself. And Kendrick took the bait. But I think it also sparked the conversation to that For sure. he does have more kids out here. Now that now that can be very much true as well too, because nigga has been traveling all over the world, and and one thing niggas do been around the world. Now you got you. <laughs> you can have my baby. <laughs> <laughs> Hey, yo, yo, I ain't gonna lie. Niggas is going to other countries and just leaving babies everywhere. I ain't gonna hold you. That That is happening. That is actually a fact. Niggas is, y'all, y'all niggas is trifling. I ain't gonna lie. Y'all niggas is, this is a bad version of Passport Rolls again. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yo. Take Cash care of your kids. These niggas. Take care but, of your babies. Um, <laughs> oh, no, my God. but I just thought it was a little weird. Mm -hmm. I know this sounds biased, but yeah, yeah. I just thought immediately like the first thing i'm gonna say is mm -hmm. i ain't been touching no kids like <laughs> you, yeah, you, yeah. Didn't, you didn't even like address that until like 48 hours later you just was like ah, 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 i told you that i i i got you like no 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 it's it's no, kind of no. honestly you're kind of damned if you do damned if you don't because if you do talk about it it kind of 
doubles down on it because anybody that does anybody that does do it and say they don't do it it doesn't matter you know what i mean it's all up to public opinion you know what i mean no, like i feel like even like for example with the meek mill situation mm-hmm. the diddy situation <laughs> like all that nigga had to yeah. say was that's a lie yeah. you said everything but that right mm-hmm. true true yeah uh I don't know. Some of these public relation people, like they'd be saying it, they're out for your best interest, but sometimes I don't, I don't know. Cause like a lot of these PR people just like, eh, it's better if you just don't say it and kill I it. I don't think anyone's taking Meek Mill's like, <laughs> yeah. um, you know, whoever is a uh, Meek Mill's PR, PR person be is probably in like constantly losing her hair. Like, fuck. <laughs> God damn it. Yeah. You're making me do my job. <laughs> right. Oh God. No, pay that woman overtime. She need help. <laughs> she need a whole staff. Um, but yeah. Um, I mean, I agree with you. Like to me, if I was in a situation like this, but I like would I said, that might just make me sound everybody. biased. But I, yeah. it's like, yeah, you. I don't know. But like I said, mm-hmm. it sparked so many more conversations about like the kids he do got out here, and it made people yeah. look into like his settlements. Oh yeah, yeah, did, yeah. Did you send me something? I did send you something. All right, let me see if I can pull this up. Um, because that. <laughs> Oh, let me see. I don't know, man. Oh, man. Let's see. I ain't going to lie. This is... um, who is this kid? Drake, this is your child, pal. <laughs> um, Mind you, that's mm-hmm. the son of the lady that he had the sexual assault. Oh, charged with. with oh. Back, way back when. Ooh. Okay. And she's been like going on interviews saying like he knows, but it's cool. My mom and dad. Then she's went and tweeted like I could have been into your career some years ago, but I let you, I let you do you. Damn, this kid do. Ja, like look, that I'm like it's kind of uncanny. Like, yo, that kid do look like Drake, mo. I ain't gonna lie, he look like Drake. Um. Then go to the like the the tweet inside of that other tweet. Where up here. Yeah, they'll click that. Right. Yep. Oh, she must have deleted it. But um, yeah, Mm. it was like baby pictures. I was like, ooh, and it looked like the baby from what's the fucking album cover? Oh, another one the same. Yeah, just like it. Mm. They look just like Afro, same Drake face. I'm like, ho. But that's the same year she came out with the interview as well. Hmm. Like 2017-ish. Right. And then, you know, there's the uh, the infamous tweet back in 2012 where it says baby girl. And then it leads up to now where a woman would, a, baby, a, a daughter would be 11 years old. Um, yeah, man. I mean, I it would not surprise me if Drake got more kids out here, honestly. I think a lot of I mean, of the baby girl tweet could be just like, and niggas call girls baby girl all the time, but. That's, that's a fact, yeah. Yeah, I don't know. Um, I I do think that this is still a misstep from Kendrick just because it seems like this was... But the shock value over... Oh, yeah. Like, just trumped... For sure. His whole... As a move, this is still perfect. You stepped on Drake's, you know, Family Matters with your theme of a family record towards him. It's a brilliant, brilliant chess move. I don't want to take that away. I just wouldn't call it flawless because yeah. there's yeah, some yeah. chinks in it. That's all I'm saying. I'm just trying to be... You know, they, they definitely say whoever comes out with receipts first wins. Facts, facts. All right, let's get back. Uh, let's get back to it. Dear Harvey, I know you probably thinking I wanted to crash your party, but truthfully, I don't have a hate bone in my body. It's supposed to be a good exhibition within the game, but you fucked up the moment you called out my family's name. Why you had to stoop so low to discredit some decent people? Guess integrity is lost when the metaphors doesn't reach you. And I like to understand, cause your house was never for a home. 37, but you showing up as a seven year old. You got gambling problems, drinking problems, pill popping and spending problems. Bad with money, poor house, soliciting women problems. Therapy's a lovely start, but I suggest some ayahuasca. Strip the ego from the bottom. 
I try to empathize with you Cause I know that you ain't been through nothing Crave entitlement But wanna be like so bad that it's puzzling No dominance Let's recap moments when you didn't fit in No secret handshakes with your friend No culture cachet to binge Just disrespecting your mother Identities on the fence Don't know which family will love you The skin that you living in Is compromised and personas Can't channel your masculine Even when standing next to a woman You a body shamer You go hide them baby mama's angel You embarrassed of them That's not right that ain't how mama raised us Take that mask off I wanna see what's under them achievements Why well, believe you You never gave us nothing to believe in Cause you lied about religious views mm. You lied about your surgery mm. You lied about your accent And your past tense All is perjury You lied about your ghost riders You mm. lied about your crew members They y'all pussy You lied on them I know they all got you in them You lied about your son You lied about your daughter huh? You lied about them other kids That's out there hoping that you come You mm. lied about the only artists That can offer you some help Fuck a rap battle, this a long life battle with yourself Bruh My god um, And that was like a lot for people to stomach They were like, I, my jaw was on the ground for like 15 minutes or something. <laughs> Yeah, this, this was a slap in the face to uh drake's record this was a perfect genius move because mm -hmm. this sucks all the air out of what drake you know did with his record with family matters honestly the family matters is the probably the most forgotten record in my opinion of the battle oh, for sure because of how quickly he stepped on it within 20 minutes people went right to this and it's so crazy because i remember watching act stream and he was about to go in and talk about the drake record and, and it was like what he was like what the second tower hit. <laughs> <laughs> and George Bush hit it like, sir, Mr. President. <laughs> Yo, um, this this was insane, man. This was absolutely insane. So, um, genius chess move. You know, it doesn't even matter if you believe everything in here is true or not. This is rap. And Kendrick wrapped his ass off doing it in a creative, artistic way. Going hard. Going at his family. Going at his son, his mother, his it, father. I'm like... I'm a fan of like, yeah. like the horror aspect. Like yeah. it got like he's like it's dark. I, that tone, the pianos, the mm, 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 it's giving mm, me Jordan mm, Peele mm. vibes. Yeah, get mm. out, <laughs> nigga. It's like wake yeah. up. Yeah, no, nah. this is hard. This is hard. Um, he's like, <laughs> let me know what you guys think, man. Do you guys are you guys fucking with this record? Do you guys what do you guys think between these two? Um. So, this is actually, it's crazy. This is not the end of the round two. Top hill, top hill. 